Yo, what is going on, you guys? It's the LK95 right here, bringing you yet another video. I hope you enjoyed my unboxing my PS Vita uh, last video. I think it was quite a good video. Um, in this gameplay, I pick up my second 100 plus in Black Ops 2. I think, I think it is, no, my fifth, but the other uh, uh, three, uh, two, third, and fourth, basically, they are 110 to like what, 65 in you know, the headquarters. So, you know, it's not really impressive. So, exactly, this one's quite impressive because I finished 110 to 13 uh, deaths, which is really impressive. It's, it's in hard point hijacked. So, you know, it's really quite good. And I wanted to explain what is the better game mode in Black Ops 3, basically, to, you know, gain 100 pluses and stuff. But first, let me quickly go over what I was using. I was using a PDW. I know I did say I wasn't using a PDW. You know, I wasn't up with the gameplay, but you know, these guys started peeing me off a bit. So I brought on PDW and to see how it went. And I did pick up a good old, um, like, what was I using at the start? I was using an MP7 at the start. And I basically was picking up 30 kills to 5. So I was like, you know what, I'm not having this no more. So exactly, I went to go to the PDW and I got myself 110 kills, which was really quite good. But you know, it's, I try my best not to use a PDW as much as I can, guys. I do really do. So, mark my words. I'm trying to shorten down these PDW gameplays and, you know, try and get some other different gameplays, basically. So, my class is PDW Science over so Fast Mag. I am uh, using Lightweight Ghost. Uh, I'm also using, what was it, uh, Scavenger and Dexterity. So, guys, I'm playing Hardpoint. Hardpoint, if you don't know, guys, it's the basic way. It's kind of like headquarters, but you don't actually, when you capture it, you don't actually die. You don't like, you have to wait for a certain amount of seconds. It's basically, you get into the hard point, you defend it off, gain the points. The more people in the hard point, the more points you get. And, you know, that's really good for XP and stuff. And also, it can be really good for score streaks as well. Because if you think about it, guys, once you kill someone off the hard point, it's a hard point kill. That's 125 points, really. That is really quite good to actually to earn your way self to the score street. So exactly, guys, if you pick yourself up a five-man feed with on the hard point, and you know you get all those points, that's around about a thousand points for just getting five kills, and that can be done in like what five seconds, and you got yourself half the score streaks already, which is really good, damn impressive to get. So, you know, that's what I mean. Wait, I think it is. No, about so nearly 1,000 or 700. Sorry, guys. I think I'm math a bit wrong here. That was really impressive to do. But I also, before also get to this topic, I actually do want to give a shout out to someone before he starts annoying me still. Uh, here's JJDHD, I think his name is. Um, basically, he did that uh, little logo thing in the right, top right hand corner. And he said he wanted to shout out. Guys, do check out his channel and subscribe to him if you want some graphics of him. Anyway. Back onto the gameplay, um, back, well, back onto the topic basically. But the thing is, is that kill confirmed, yes, it is good, you can get tags and stuff. But if you pick up your own tag, you have to go and pick up an enemy's tag and you have to get the uh, kill confirmed off it, and it can be quite difficult. And you know, it's kind of like you got to rush your tag, you know, it's kind of like rushing more, you got to rush more, you got to do what you can. I'm not saying hard point is bad, like hard points for camping and stuff. You know, I'm not saying that that's just a bad idea. You know, like I was doing this gameplay, I was rushing around, going near hard points, taking people off the hard point, get back in the hard point, off it, you know, keep going in and off it. And but for like kill confirm, you can just sit on your own tag and deny your own tag, but you only get 25 to 9 points, so it's kind of pointless. But you know what I mean, guys. It's like kind of like that situation and stuff like that. It, like for Ground War as well, 9v9 domination does really work well. That's how the big YouTube picks off their game release. But sometimes you can get 100 pluses, mostly in hard point. So guys, if you are going for um, yeah, basically high game place in 6v6, go for hard point. Most um, good way to get it. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit that subscribe button up the top. Possibly hit that like button as well. Leave a comment below saying which mode you like better. I would actually like to know what you like better. And guys, I'll see you in my next video. Until then, peace!